My name is Ilay Alon. I'm with Tel Aviv University Department of Philosophy, teaching here a course at the uh, Venice International University on uh, Al-Farabi, a medieval philosopher in uh, Iraq and Syria, uh, whom I hold to be the greatest uh, Arab philosopher of all times. He uh, occupies a position in the history of Arab philosophy uh, of centrality, both in terms of importing ideas from um, Greece, Plato, Aristotle, and exporting them to medieval Europe, both in uh, Judaism through Maimonides and Christianity through St. Thomas Aquinas, later on to Spinoza and uh, the Third Rome. The reason why I chose him, and especially his book on the perfect city, is that uh, he symbolizes, for me he signifies, signifies the peak of Arab and Islamic culture at the 10th century. Um, both from a geographical point of view, he lived in the center of the empire, a uh, chronological point of view, the 10th century is the peak of what is called the uh, golden era of uh, medieval Arab philosophy and uh, culture, and also from the point of view of ideas and uh, input to, uh, to philosophy. Uh, we concentrate in the seminar that uh, I'm conducting uh, on his political philosophy, which is influenced on the one hand by Plato and Aristotle, and on the other hand by Islam. But uh, on top of these uh, two inputs, he manages to create a very special, very individual, and very contributive kind of political philosophy, which is a universalistic one, namely basing himself on the ideas that people more or less behave, think, um, talk, um, conduct societies in similar ways regardless of religion and um, nationality. Uh, a quite uh, a courageous uh, kind of idea for his time and I think he does the job uh, most convincingly and courageously. Uh, the um, idea of the course is to acquaint the students with this personality and to try and um, lure them into learning some more uh, Arab philosophy and Arab culture.